Welcome to the first in our last series of films, which deals with the topic of building services. In it, we explain what the term building services means. The term building services refers to the fitting out of buildings with service plant and equipment. The building you can see here, our Remshalden Rose Pavilion, is one of the few examples of a building with absolutely no building services. It has no heating, no lighting, no wireless network, and is not connected to the water mains. The simplest residential construction of this kind is something you are all familiar with, the tent. But what exactly does this plant and equipment do? Firstly, it supplies a building with energy, electrical energy, that is electricity, thermal energy for heating, and cooling energy for air conditioning. It also supplies buildings with certain consumable materials. We use water for washing, showering, cooking, and drinking. Air has to be brought into buildings and rooms with no windows for ventilation. Gas is another of these materials. It may simply be natural gas for heating and cooking, or special gases for laboratories and manufacturing processes, etc. Once they've been brought in and used, some of these materials then have to be disposed of. Water quickly becomes wastewater as soon as it leaves the tap, in fact. It has to be disposed of in a controlled manner and returned to the water cycle. Air introduced through ventilation ducts is consumed by the people who breathe it in, reducing its oxygen content and increasing its CO2 content. This used air is then extracted and vented to the outside. In certain cases, it may also be necessary to dispose of gases such as combustion gases, for example. Technical plant and equipment can also supply buildings with data. This includes telecommunication services such as telephone, internet and data transmission access, but also simpler devices such as clocks. Building services also include mechanical equipment for moving and handling people and goods, including lifts, escalators, conveyor belts and cranes. Special purpose buildings generally require specialised technical equipment. Hotels and restaurants need special kitchen equipment, theatres demand stage technology systems, and laboratories require laboratory equipment such as extraction systems and workbenches. The human race is constantly striving to make life easier through the use of automation technology. The resulting equipment, which forms a separate subcategory of building services equipment, is designed to measure conditions and operate building services plant by means of open and closed loop control systems. You can see some typical examples here. A fire door that closes only when smoke alarms have detected a fire and lifts that do not all rush to the same floor when called. Summary. The term building services refers to the fitting out of buildings with service plant and equipment. Technical plant and equipment provide buildings with energy, water and data. Consumables such as water and air that are brought into a building must then be removed with the aid of technical systems. Building services also include mechanical equipment for moving and handling people and goods, including lifts, escalators, conveyor belts and cranes. Our Building Services series continues with film number two, which looks at how building services are categorised.